Uh, fire season is never something that's fun to cover. I spent many years on the West Coast and man, this time of year is tough. They're hoping for those rains to return. Here's a live look at our camera that's shaking all around. Oh, making me dizzy. We are looking at breezy conditions across the region. So that's what's shaking the camera. The fountain though, looking pretty good. It's going to feel like summer this week. So hopefully you might have plans to head down to the city of Detroit and enjoy the beach that is still out there. And it is still out there for at least another month, even not if not even more than that. As we take Take a look at temperatures at this moment. We have the low 70s across the region. Lapeer, you just popped up to 75 degrees, mainly mostly sunny skies, a couple of clouds hanging around. But overall, we are looking at calm conditions across Metro Detroit. You can see mostly sunny skies through the region, a couple more clouds off to the north and east. And there's actually some rain sliding through Canada on its way towards Toronto. A couple of thunderstorms there, too. This is a week, a little disturbance that's swinging just to our northeast. We'll just see a couple of clouds from it. But because of this disturbance and high pressure building in from the Southwest, we have a tight pressure gradient, which means the pressure changes over a distance. And when you have that happen, that means that we look at strong winds and at times we are looking at gusty winds and that's exactly what we're seeing today. Now, right now, the sustained winds are at about 15 miles per hour, but we've had gusts near 25 miles per hour. Our winds are starting to change direction from what we've had throughout the weekend. Our winds this weekend were mainly out of the north and northwest, so pulling in the cooler air. But now winds are starting to come a little bit more out of the south. south Southwest as we get into this afternoon and that's going to pull in some warmer temperatures and we'll see that temperature climb as we continue through the rest of the week, but still expect some breezy conditions over the next few hours. Our winds will be strongest, especially within the next about two to three hours, gust 25 to even up to 30 miles per hour. Eventually our winds will weaken as we move into tonight and we are looking at weaker winds overall as we move through the next couple of days as high pressure again builds in and when you have a high centered over you, you usually have lighter winds. So we will be seeing that in our coming days. As we take a look at temperatures this afternoon, it will be warmer than what we saw this weekend. Highs on Saturday were in the upper 50s and low 60s. Yesterday they were in the upper 60s and low 70s. Today they're going to be in the upper 70s to near 80 degrees. We are going 80 in Detroit surrounding areas. Quite a few spots will fall just shy of that 80 degree mark, but overall it's still going to be a nice summer like day and a day very close to average Our average high 77 for today. 80s continue, but we start to climb a bit more 81 for your high on Tuesday, the mid to upper 80s to end the week. Our warmest day does look to be Thursday there with highs into the upper 80s. As we get into the weekend, we'll keep an eye on a chance for some rain, which is part of a system, a tropical system that is eventually going to become likely category one strength hurricane Francine. So watching that, but as of right now, that rain might not make it to us. So looking at some dry conditions, at least for the next six days and maybe the next seven days ahead. We'll be right back.